Active Campaign Annual Reminder. We're going to set up an automation that has goals at every month in the year. It sends out reminder emails, it repeats, and it also removes non customers. So let's dive right in. So I built in automation called the Annual Reminder. It looks like this there's no trigger, you're, you're responsible for getting a person in there. But basically, this would be good use of um, an automation to remind people that they've paid you an annual subscription. It can be a shocker to get that bill every once a year and get dinged without having any kind of warning. So this is one way to soften the blow, if you will. Now, I could have made it shorter and streamlined, but there's some reasons I did what I did. So basically, you want to come in, put them in there, wait for one month, set a goal, which is basically tagging them with, um, if they have a tag called one, month one, they get pulled through there. Repeat this for every month, wait another month. There's a goal called month, month two. So if they have a tag called month two, they get pulled through here. Month three, and then I just put this as kind of a break. And then we down to month 11. Now the reason we put these goals in here is because what if you set this up after somebody has already been an annual subscriber for say about two months. Well, in that case, you put them in here and then you also apply the month two tag to put them in the approximately right location. You can be a little bit safer and maybe put them in month three, but the, so they'll get reminded earlier than they would otherwise. But a little more work makes it a little bit easier in case something doesn't go right. Or for whatever reason you want to move somebody faster through it, you can simply apply a month tag that's later on and we'll pull them to that step. So yes, you could have just simply waited, you know, 52 weeks or 50 weeks and then started sending emails, but instead break it up into months or even quarters, just at least to get people close to it. If you set this up after the customer or client has been added to an annual plan. Once you get down to like month 11, my recommendation is wait for a couple weeks, send them an email reminder. It says, hey, you're gonna get charged uh, for your annual membership coming up soon so that they know. Wait another week, send the same email. Wait six days, send the third, same email the third time. So this is basically one day before they get charged. So they could get three different emails or three of the same emails reminding them that they're gonna get paid. However, set another goal right down here, which says if they open any of those emails, then jump down to here. So if you send this first reminder email, they open it, they've read it apparently, they're gonna jump right down to here. And then what you wanna do is, and this, um, I did it this way simply so that I could have them loop back up. You wanna check for a tag that says they're no longer a customer or effectively they should no longer get a reminder. And that goal might be a tag called customer inactive. Now, if you think about it, if anywhere up above you apply the customer inactive, they're gonna get pulled through and this isn't, isn't necessary. But what it does is it splits them down to this path so that you can end this automation for them. Otherwise, if they get those three emails, two, one, whatever, and they don't cancel, guess what? Send them right back to the top and loop them through again for the next year. Alternatively, if you just want to remind them once in their annual subscription and not any subsequent years, you can simply end this automation also. So that's how you can set up an annual reminder automation in ActiveCampaign.